Yo, what is up guys? Welcome to a new video. Today I'm gonna talk about the plugin I discovered, I think, last week. Okay, it's called Wider. And, well, the name says everything, you know, it's to make your sounds wider. And they say you're not gonna have any face problems, okay? This means that when you put your track in mono, for example, in festivals or in clubs, or in your phone or things like that, um, you're not gonna have any problem with that sound, okay? It's not gonna be decreased in volume or things like that. So that's what I'm gonna try uh, today. I'm gonna test this plugin if it really works. I have to say that this plugin is completely free, okay? Uh, you have a link in the in the description below, so you can go there and download the plugin and try it. It's n it doesn't have a pay option, okay? It's completely free. And also you have uh, in the description too a link to download the stems on my track alone, okay? I said that if we got to 50 likes in the last video, I will give the the stems of the track. We didn't get to 50 likes. But I've, uh, as I got a lot of likes on, on the video, I wanted to give some of the stems. So uh, in the description, you will have the leads, the sub, the the baseline, and the chords. Okay, you can compare with yours. And just that, guys. Let's get to the video. Okay, guys. So here I have three kinds of sounds. Okay, the first one is just a sample, a simple snare. Second one is a synth. And the third one is a vocal. To test if this really works, uh, on the master I'm going to put uh, two kind of plugins. The first one is uh, SM Exoscope. Uh, this uh, tells you the waveform of what is sounding. And the second one is the Ozone Imager, okay, to check uh, if it's out of phase on the spectrum and so on. Okay, so let's start first with the snare. I have here Wider, okay, Wider is this plugin. It's so simple, just click here and drag to the right or click here and drag to the left and increases the, the width. Okay, so uh, before using it, I'm gonna take the snare here and here, okay? Okay, uh, here is the peak of the snare without any processing. Um, and here, as you can see, you have some uh, stereo info, but not that much. Okay, so we're gonna try using wider. I'm gonna uh, be increasing the, the width of it slowly. And let's see what happens here. Okay, so if you're listening with with headphones or with your speakers and so on, uh, you can hear that it makes the sound wider, okay? Uh, if we look here on the spectrum, uh, it changes completely the, the sound, the wave, okay? And here it's super wide, it's over the line, so if it goes down of this line to minus one, it's out of phase and you can have some problems. But let's try to make it even wider. As we can see, it never crosses the line, okay? Uh, but the wave will change it. So what I'm gonna try now is to make it uh, mono after using this plugin. And as you can see and hear, uh, it's exactly the same as before. So if I disable the plugin, sound like this, and if I enable the plugin, It sounds mostly the same, okay? Maybe you can hear some um, like white noise or uh, delay or something like that. But it's more or less the same, it's at the same volume and everything. So with the snare it works, okay? If you put it in mono, you're not gonna have... If you put the, the plugin to the max, okay, you make it so wide, uh, you're not gonna have any problem with, with for example, the snare or, or a sample that is not super wide. But if we put, for example, uh, S1 Imager, what it does is to make the sound wider, okay? Also, like wider, but with another, with a different algorithm. As it doesn't get to the, to the line, I'm gonna use another one to make it sound uh, the same, with the same width as with wider. More or less here, okay. Now it's in theory is uh, as wider as using wider, okay. As we can see, the waveform is different. Um, but if we put this in mono, as you can see, it's a lot quieter, okay. It's a lot quieter. So this means that you're gonna ha you're having some problems and you're reducing the info on the on the mid section or right on the center. 
So maybe you didn't really want that, it depends on the sound of course. But for example in this case, uh, in this snare, it's better to use wider. The thing is that with wider, it's like um, with S1 you're opening the sound, but with wider it's like you're um, cloning the sound and you're putting to the left and to the right, right? It's like using a, uh, a delay. Let's try now with a synth, it's just a normal saw, um, it's, it's in mono, you just have one voice. Okay, I'm gonna try wider also with this sound. As before, uh, it well, it doesn't really cross the line, just a little bit, but this doesn't really affect on, on the sound. And let's try now to put in mono. It doesn't change the sound at all, because as it is in mono and you put the wider, if you make it now in mono, it, it's like it doesn't affect. With the snare, as it had uh, a little bit of a stereo info, it affected a bit. But now what I'm gonna do, is uh, take silence, make it uh, stereo. Okay, I'm not using wider, but it's wide. So now I'm gonna try to use the plugin and see what happens. As we can see here, it uh, affects a bit to the. It, it makes it out of phase, okay? But it sounds weird. It depends on where you are, it sounds different. But if we make it completely white, uh, it doesn't make it out of phase. Okay, and now I'm gonna do the same. I'm gonna make it mono to see if it, um, if it changes uh, the sound or what without the plugin. With the plugin. Okay, so now as you can see, it affects the sound in mono. So um, this plugin really works if the sound is already mono in the beginning, so you can make it wider without any phase problem, and then when you put the track in mono, it's gonna sound the same. But if the tra the sound is already uh, stereo and you make it wider, if you put the track in mono later to listen in some speakers or clubs or so on, you're gonna have some problems, okay? The sound is gonna sound weird, but it can sound nice course I mean it's not gonna be out of phase but it's like uh, uh, using an effect you know it's like uh, s changing the sound you can maybe you like the, the the effect it gives and now let's try it with the vocal Cause I don't wanna as you can see it's already wide okay it goes uh, to minus one a bit but just a little bit this is not really a problem let's try before and after without the plugin Cause I don't wanna leave that way. with the plugin Cause I don't wanna leave that way. as you can see here uh, it makes it louder and as you can hear okay and let's try to put it in mono now without the plugin in mono Cause I don't wanna leave with the plugin in mono Cause I don't wanna leave that it doesn't really affect the sound, but it's like I said with the uh, with the uh, with the snare, it changes just a little bit because as it is already in stereo, it affects a bit to the sound because I think Wilder is using some kind of delay, so you're making that delay mono, but you're not uh, touching the 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 info on the center, right? The mono info. Alright, so now, do I recommend this plugin? Well, it, it, it's kind of good, you know, for example, in some vocals you can use it and it, it works nice, it makes it wider, but in a nice way, you know. Um, for synth and so on, you can try it because, it, as I said, it's, it changes the sound a bit, it's like using an effect, not just a, a plugin that makes the sound wider. And with sample and so on, you can use it, but um, be really careful because um, if the sound, if the sample has some attack, like for example the snare, you're gonna have that attack uh, duplicated to the sides, and it's gonna sound a bit weird. You can use it, but just a little bit. Okay, so I recommend you to to download this plugin. It's for f completely for free. Okay, and just just try things. Just try it in in lot of sound with just a little bit with a lot of. Uh, 
uh, with, you know, uh, using the plugin to the max. Nothing else. Um, leave a comment if you if you have any question about this plugin. Uh, download it for free. The link is in the description. And uh, like, give a like if you like this video. And guys, see you in the next video. Yeah,